Hey what's up guys, that's Kazooie here and welcome to episode 130 of A Skill Into Glory and uh, we're going to start off by going into the first game of the episode we come against a pretty strong looking team especially those four players, we got Marco Royce, record breaker Cristiano Ronaldo, Neymar and also Garrett Bill playing as a, a centre attack in mid but uh, is us starting off in the 13th minute with Ronaldo, a nice elastico and we actually do pick up a penalty in the 14th minute already it is uh, the main man of the team, Pelé who steps up for it but his goalkeeper actually saves it it. Not really the greatest way to start this game, missing a penalty. Then uh, the 18th minute, it is again Pelé there on the ball with some great skill moves. Uh, we beat two of his defenders, then we run towards the goalkeeper, try to go for a near post finish. I think he shoot it with the outside of his foot, but a pretty easy save for the goalkeeper. Then at uh, 24th minute, uh, we got the ball with Gullet. I tried to reach out to Pelé, we lose the ball. That's my opponent who goes on the attack there with Ronaldo himself. I couldn't really catch up. I tried to sort of set some pressure with my goalkeeper. And therefore we made a foul with Edwin van der Sar. Luckily enough we didn't pick up a red card. But still we had to try to save this penalty as well. Just like my opponent did. But you can see he actually converts it into a goal. Making it 1-0 for him. Then at 35th minute he actually managed to get himself another chance with Ronaldo. Some pretty terrible defending on my side. A brilliant save there from van der Sar. Then he crossed it back in with Neymar I think. Crossed it over to Ronaldo. A great header. Again a really nice save from van der Sar. And then from the Rio that is Bill with some sort of a chip shot I think. Which I don't think he meant to. But um, yeah my opponent had some big chances as well. Could have been 2-0 or maybe even 3-0. We got another chance in the 45th minute with Wellington Silva. But a great save for his goalkeeper. I can see from the halftime stats. They were a little bit in our favour. We had a couple more shots. Also a little bit more possession and therefore I decided to make some changes because I felt we kind of lacked scoring a uh, scoring ability especially with that uh, with Neymar on the bench I thought it would be better to bring him on I also decided to bring on DeMarco since he's a bit uh, a bit faster than uh, Kuntrao and we had to play against Royce, Ronaldo and Bill which are also very very fast so uh, I decided to bring him on uh, we got the first chance again with Pele but a great save from his goalkeeper then uh, 55th minute five minutes later is Neymar on the ball with his first chance we got some great skill moves going and we actually do pick up a goal as well off the post then I think a really really nice skill goal making it 1-1 making it all even in this game then uh, 58th minute, 3 minutes later, Okocha on the ball, plays it off to Pele, a nice fake shot there to beat his defender. We kind of slow down a little bit, we take some time, we go with a nice finesse shot around the goalkeeper, making it 2-1 and actually gives a lead in the game. But then only a few minutes later, he goes on the attack with Ronaldo. I just couldn't stop him, he changed direction so, so quickly, it was pretty difficult to stop him and yeah, he, uh, he makes it 2-2. I could have tackled him of course, but then I probably would have risked another penalty and maybe even a red card as well. But it didn't really matter that much because like 3 minutes later, we we got another chance with Pele, a brilliant pass from Hernandez, I have to say that. And we pick up another goal with him as well, making it 3-2. I can see at the end of the game as well, we picked up another man of the match with Pele, which is the fourth one already. I can see stats-wise, we're completely dominating the whole game, so it was uh, it was sort of a deserved win, I guess, for us. But anyway, we jump into uh, into the second game, coming up against a Premier League team, pretty strong one. Team this season, Harry Kane, I think second or third in form, Sanchez as well, and also Walcott. So uh, again, a pretty a pretty strong front three we had to play against. It was us starting off this time with Okocha with some really, really nice body feints, beating the defenders, and we put it into the back of the net, making it 1-0. A really, really nice way to, uh, to start off this game, uh, if you compare it to the previous game where we missed that penalty then a uh, six minute and it's Pele on the ball we get fouled apparently so we picked him a free kick we take it short we play it off to Okocha was on the edge of the box we go with a really really nice skill combo there the fake Rabone to the Blanco hop you all know it I use that one so so much it is so effective and uh, we make it 2-0 another goal with Okocha as well really really nice one then a uh, 20th minute it is Okocha once again on the ball plays it on through to Pele goes with the in-air Elastico beats the defender there we play it off to Okocha with the scoop turn we lose the ball we pick it up with Gullit a nice flick up and we actually dink it just into the back of the net a really really nice goal and I just love the way the, the ball actually didn't bounce the ground when we actually scored so a really really nice goal and we also uh, we also get the first uh, in-air skill move goal as well from uh, from juggling a really really nice one overall then uh, we continue on you can see right there I tried to go for something fancy with Ronaldo a fake Rabona to a Rabona cross trying to reach Pele but he got the defender uh, quite a, quite easily by my opponent then uh, from a corner he managed to get himself a chance uh, nice shot there great save from the goalkeeper then uh, from the rebound I think it is Harry Kane with a really really nice volley just went over the crossbar so towards the end of the first half my opponent was kind of pushing to get himself the goal and actually managed to get himself the goal really early on into the second half I think two or three minutes in makes it three to one with the man that is Harry Kane so um, yeah it was uh, sort of 
becoming a little bit more intense because we were 3-0 up then all of a sudden it was 3-1 but then after that we created so many chances as well here again as well with that with Pelly could have been such a nice goal but unfortunately got deflected by the defenders so um, yeah we pick up a corner we go on a skill run with Ronaldo we pull up a skill move inside the box and we pick up a penalty said it in the previous episode it's really really easy to, uh, to pick up penalties in this game and it's actually ridiculous how easy it is or at least how bad the referees are that is kind of the the main kind of problem with this game but anyway we uh, we convert with Pelé we make it 4-1 then uh, 66 minutes some awesome stuff as well from Ronaldo lovely Rabona pass to Pelé tried to go on a skill run with him as well after that nice flick up uh, we beat most of his defenders a nice shot with the weak foot but a brilliant save from his goalkeeper then uh, a couple of minutes later he plays it on through to Sanchez who was completely free I thought he was going to pass it across but he went with sort of a near post finish with uh, with Sanchez putting it into the back of the net making it 4-2 and again sort of set some pressure on me because after that he got himself another chance with Harry Kane hitting the post so could have been 4-3 we could have sort of given away the game but luckily enough we, uh, we didn't do that and in the 90th minute we got the final chance of the game there with Pelé after Soma some really really nice skill moves we beat most of his defenders we sort of beat the goalkeepers out with the ball roll and we put it into the back of the net once again with Pelé making it 5-2 and uh, also pick up the, uh, the 13th skill goal I think in total and uh, you can see as well once again we do pick up another man of the match which I think is the fifth one which means we complete that challenge which is really really awesome so we got the second challenge completed was really happy with that one then uh, we go into the final game we come up against a team in the 4 3 2 1 formation with six five star skillers pretty much a full brazilian team with a pretty pretty strong defense as well also with the two team of the year players the team of the year uh, tiago silva and team of the year david luis i think and um yeah his team name was uh, was called skill school so i expected some uh, some skill moves from this guy as well he didn't message me uh, or tweet me after the game so i don't really know if it was a subscriber but uh, it was a pretty pretty fun game especially the first few minutes for us anyway we created a lot of chances unfortunately though the shots were not really the best here as well i tried to go for an in air elastico beating that defender but for some reason ronaldo was not able to pull it off it was pretty weird looking but uh, eventually we uh, we went with a shot end up hitting the crossbar then at 19 minutes, we're still pretty early on into the game. Ronaldo once again on the ball. A fake or a bone to a scoop pass to a two Pele. A lovely volley hitting the post once again in this game the second time. And still we're pretty early on into the game. So we had some really, really big chances. But as I said... Our finishing was not really on point in this game. It was uh, it was pretty annoying, but still, since it was sort of a skill game, I guess it was uh, it was not really that big of a deal. But still, chances like this where Pele not going on target was uh, was kind of annoying, especially since I just knew as soon my opponent would only get like one big chance, he would get himself a goal. I knew I would kind of throw away the whole game. So you can see from the halftime stats, 60% possession. We had a lot of shots, as I mentioned, hit the crossbar in the post as well. So um, yeah, we went to the second half uh, trying to at least score early goal we had a big chance with Ronaldo the ball got cleared off the line there by David Luiz then we got sort of a rebound shot in with Pele would have been such a nice finish if that back heel actually went properly on target but the defender was just in a way to block it off then at 72nd minute we got the ball with Gullit a nice body frame to cut inside a pretty simple goal but I want to take it just because I didn't want to throw away this game because I knew as I said if my opponent would get himself a big chance he would take it and that is what happened right there he sprints past every single one of my players including the goalkeeper makes it 1-1 and then in my opinion anyway sort of celebrates in a cocky way like he he dominated the whole game or something even though he created nothing so I was kind of annoyed especially since like the way he played as well he did some skill moves in his own half and didn't really like show that much it was kind of me just pressuring the whole game but then in the 90th minute we got a penalty and we actually do make it 2-1 to one in the 90th minute. So I was really, really happy. You can see as well from the final stats. We had a lot of shots on target. Or at least a lot of shots in total. Only 8 on target. Which is still a decent amount. But I think we, we, we probably should have won this game with like 3 or maybe 4 goals. But sometimes you just have one of those games where nothing really seems to go into the back of the net. Which is annoying. And I guess this was just one of those games. But anyway, we move into the skillers up. You can see right there. We're currently on 18 goals with Pele. And uh, we've also scored 13 skill goals so far. We've managed to complete two challenges so far so i think it is going uh, really really well but anyway guys that is going to be the end of this video hope you enjoyed it if you did then make sure to leave a like would be very much appreciated and if you can hit 3,000 likes that would be absolutely awesome so thank you very much for watching and i'll see you guys later Bye bye